James Melendez, a very simple video on how to create a playlist for your videos in YouTube Studio. Stay tuned. Please give a like and subscribe to this channel. There are two ways of creating a brand new playlist. I'll show you how to do this. The first is very simple. So if you're uploading a video that you just created, you can create a playlist from that. So let's do that right here. Here's an example video. We'll just call this video operational video. So all you have to do is scroll down to playlist, select playlist, go to new playlist. You'll see new playlist and new podcast. You want to select new playlist. I'll enter in here the name of the new playlist. As an example, we're just going to call this operational playlist. Here, I'm going to enter in some description. While you have a lot of space here to enter in some information on the playlist, up to 5,000 characters, and I always put some information such as my link tree here. So this can be indexed on a search, and when somebody's searching, and maybe they enter in operational playlist, and I want somebody to see that, I want to make sure they have a way of connecting with me and finding me perhaps not just my YouTube channel, but other places as well. So I can hit create. And in this example, I'm not going to hit create. So let's cancel out of this. Now, let me show you the second method. When you look at this list, you want to go to playlist. That's the immediate thought. Here, there's no way to create a playlist. So that's uh, unfortunate. There should be a way to do that, but there isn't. What you need to do is go to either videos or shorts. I'm going to go to videos. And in videos, you can select all or you could just select one of these. I think the best practice for me is just to select one, just in case somehow I affiliate this with a new playlist. I do not want to affiliate everything, especially if there's no reason for all those videos to be in that playlist. So let's go to add to playlist. Go down a new playlist. You'll see the new playlist again, and let's enter in the title. And just as we did before, we enter in the title and then the description. So I want to make sure again this is filled out just as I did in the first example and make this public. So let's create this. Now you can see that one video that I selected would go in the operational playlist. I'm going to save that. So that's why you want to be careful and not select all videos because they may not be in that particular category or type of video. So you just want to watch out for that. So I'm going to show you a different playlist that I have and how this ranks and what this looks like to somebody who is doing a search. For example, if somebody was doing a search on, they wanted to find of videos on, say, Chief of Staff, and they're going to list, say, YouTube playlist. So let's select this and do this search. You're going to see right here, that's me. And this particular ranking is first page. It is the first result. That's pretty impressive. And that doesn't happen very often, but that's one example. And we're seeing the output here. What you're going to see here on this playlist is some copy. And again, you're going to see that link tree for me right there. You'll want to, you know, balance that, that with you to create the right number of playlists and not too many either. And I'm glad that it does so because a lot of people do search for this and do find my content. And so this is one good reason to have as much information. What if somebody did not know about your YouTube channel? Here, you have a way of introducing yourself. And this is one way so people can look at the videos, play them all, shuffle them, but also have some immediate information on you. And also to understand maybe some of the copy here and how it may be relevant for what they're looking for. I hope this video has been helpful. Please give a like, subscribe to this channel, and be sure to share this video with somebody who has a question about how to create their own playlist for a video that they've created on YouTube in the YouTube studio. So thank you for watching. I do appreciate it. Please give a like and subscribe to this channel. James Melendez, James the Tech Guy. I will see you very soon. Thank you.